With this session update, I'm Shannon Lurkey. The Senate has unanimously passed a bill now headed to the governor's desk for his signature that would provide $20 million to fund further research into Lou Gehrig's disease, also known as ALS, with an additional $5 million to help the caregivers of those suffering from the deadly degenerative illness. Senator Tom Bach read a statement on behalf of the bill's author, Senator David Tomasoni, who is suffering from the disease. It's been an emotional several weeks for me and my family, one full of love and overwhelming gratitude. I am so proud of this legislature for coming together in almost unanimous support of an issue that's bigger than all of us. I'm especially proud and grateful for this body's unanimous support. This bill has the potential to be the beginning of eradication of an insidious disease, not for me, but for future generations. That is something we can all be proud of. Lou Gehrig died of ALS in 1941, and for far too long, little to nothing has been done in research to uncover new and effective treatments for ALS. This bill, along with the Healy clinical trials, offers a momentous opportunity to make significant progress towards a cure right here in Minnesota. If we do nothing else this session, and I really want a big bonding bill. <laughs> is, that, is, is that David or what? <laughs> Mr. Leader? Uh, and I really want a big bonding bill. We can all say we've accomplished something significant, something significant in virtual unanimous fashion. I have to thank each and every one of you, in particular Senator Box, Senator Housley, all my co-authors, Representative Liz Lagarde, Representative New, Speaker Hortman, Majority Leader Miller, basically 67 senators and 121 House members and the governor for passing this bill. There being 67 ayes and no nays, Senate File 3372 does pass its title agreed to. To continue following these issues and more, watch legislative coverage Monday through Friday on the PBS Minnesota channel or visit our website, www.senate.mn/media.